You see her back there working, working away. What are you doing, Donna? I'm sorting. She's sorting. This is what she does for you people. She does it for you. She does it for the people that are coming to the garage sale. But really, um, let's get her out of there and let's get this video started. All right, Donna is out from her <laughs> from from her little hole in the garage. I don't know. It's in my treasure trove. Treasure trove. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome back. We are Happy Heart Treasures. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. And we are resellers in Lincoln, Nebraska. Rehomers of stuff. That too. Donna's getting ready for the garage sale. We're going to show you the garage. It's getting pretty uh, chaotic, but she's We're going to rehome a lot of stuff because everything is one dollar. Yes, and I want to say the words that Donna likes to hear from me most of any words. Well, maybe I love you is more. Yes. But I, I you was wrong. What? I was wrong. I was wrong. Well... Was what? I really wrong? <laughs> I think you were just having a bad week, honey, and and you just... No, to be technical, mm. to be to be fair, I didn't say that we were getting scammed. I said question mark. Are we getting scammed? I'm not really <laughs> sure. So I never really took, I never really posted my flag on the we are getting scammed because I really don't like to think that we're getting scammed. No, we're usually very. Um, what's the word? to to giving yeah we really try to see the good in people and when people give us a, a anything they tell us something that don't work out or whatever and, and we usually just give them the benefit of the doubt and we say oh no, that's probably it's probably this probably that whatever well anyway the teacups we talked about in the last video oh not, the teacups and platters yes. yeah not only did i hear back from them the next day so yesterday yesterday afternoon but have they actually a little patience. <laughs> well, but when you do these videos and you do them like yeah. every day or two and you're just talking about what's on your mind, then you're going to get truth and it ain't yeah, always, it turns out what's something on changes. Yeah. So not only did they come back and message and very nicely and fix their address issues, but they even bought the third set. There was a third color that was in there and so they actually bought more. And we're going to show them to you along with uh, some other things that sold. Yeah. And we're going to go over the garage and we're going to talk about some comments we received on that last video because I just want to touch on a few. Let's show them what's and coming up for the garage sale. And we're going to do all them things. Kay. Stick around. All right, Donna, explain what our garage situation is right now. Okay, first of all, come back here and see that they are too deep, floor to ceiling, too deep. And I have all of these ready for the garage sale. And what we do is we just pull the totes out, take the lid off, and... Kind of like the Goodwill bins, only yeah, it's the better. Happy Heart bins. It's better. Yeah. I've got these clothes ready to go. These, I'm going to fill this up so that it's full of uh, garage sale stuff. This is up my stuff to uh, keep and list. Um, and then that's our personal and stuff to keep in list back there. But, so on the day of the garage sale, we will take everything out. We'll set a few things up on the tables in here and move the clothes out. I'm going to bring another rack. We'll have clothes racks and let people have edits. Cool. So, yep. Yeah. All right. So on this table, this is my stuff. I was working out here yesterday and listing. Mm -hmm. This is like my to do next pile. Here's some of our what solds. Can't look at that yet. This is stuff that's listed on dollar auction that will end later today. So it will be gone. This is my starting. Uh, that's listed. This that is her today. listed on dollar auction. This I'll list um, the night before we leave um, Plains Profit. That would be, oh, before we come home. So yep. it ends that night or whatever. Yep. So yeah, we're and just, she's back here sorting, getting all the stuff from under the tables that we neglect for a while. Yep. And working on this, getting ready. Believe it or not, that table will be cleared off for the garage sale. Yeah. We thought we were going to have another clean out next weekend. Um, it turns out we are not. The family is going to clean that one out after the sale. So, and that's cool. That will give us a full weekend of like listing and preparing and stuff like that. It's kind of good to have a weekend off every now and then to actually do like our eBay job and our dollar auction job. <laughs> so, well, let's jump into the what solds. The eBay gods, I don't believe there's eBay gods. The eBay gods punished me for even thinking that someone might be trying to scam me so the ebay god said i shall make you ship highly breakable things <laughs> and <laughs> so, i don't think that's punishment <laughs> i think that's awesome so we have a few highly breakable things um really cool things to show you so let's get into that 
we might as well start with the teacups, right? Yeah, where are they at? All right. <laughs> These came from the buyout from our cousins in Arkansas. And we're going to unwrap these and show you. This Can is... I take them? Yes, we need to take them all the way out and show them. Let's do that. All right, so here is our teacups. The famous teacups. It's not a scam. They're I don't really think so they're famous. They're infamous. Infamous. Look, it's actually three plates. I didn't even realize that. Mm -hmm. um, three plates and a cup for each one. Uh, looks pretty breakable. Yeah. But yeah, they had bought the, I think it was the blue and the yellow. And so then when they message back, they, they message and they're like, oh, I'm going to go ahead and get all three of those. I fixed my shipping address. So can you just help me with combined shipping? So I'm, yeah, I'm definitely going to, I told, they went ahead and paid for all three of them plus shipping. And so I'm going to package this all nine plates and three cups breakable. <laughs> and, <laughs> and then I'll ship it and I'll refund them the shipping <laughs> overage that they, uh, that they paid so yeah not only did they sell but they all three sold instead of just two of them so that nice. was fun nice all right donna what else we got going on here we got these norwex little bibs yep and we have actually 10 of them yep there's 10 uh one person messaged and they asked if they bought all 10 because i had them listed for i don't know seven eight bucks or something they said if you buy if we buy all 10 would you take four dollars a piece piece plus shipping and so 10 of them, 40 bucks. Uh, what did do you, remember where we got them? I, I was thinking I, it was the bins. You were thinking no. it was the thrift store in Kansas City. Is but that, it didn't say on there? No, it didn't. Uh, what, that was for a while ago. I don't know, I can't remember. Anyway, 40 bucks for those. They're going out. All right, Donna, let's see what else you got. I found these when we went with those Ruth and cool. Larry to help them move to Lyons and we brought them back to get another load and we had to stop at a thrift store. So we got these for $5 and they sold for $19.99. So that's cool. It's a little spice, spice yeah. books. And they're, they were new in the box, but the box was um, disintegrated basically. Trash. Yeah. Okay. So I don't think they've ever had spice in them. I see. And then these guys, yeah, these, more more highly breakables. These are the <laughs> tall ones. Usually, usually you see the shorter ones, but these are the the really big ones. Yeah, these and are like fourteen inches tall. This came. Are from, these Homeco? Yeah. Yeah, Homeco. Man, them were big. Yeah. They they came from Giles. The Giles clean out. And uh, they sold for $52. 52 plus shipping and like $30 shipping. She did have plenty of room for shipping, so I'll do the best I can with them. But man, they were Yeah, big. you have to remember these little flowers have petals on them. Yeah. So you've really got to be careful. I'll get it well protected. Yeah. All right, then a cookbook. We started Shit. doing cookbooks when Shed Flips started doing cookbooks a little bit after they did. And I thought, well, we find some of them around. So this one's from Goodyear here in Lincoln. Yep, and it's sold for twelve dollars. Nice. What's this? Um, this is Tarzan Collection DVD lot. This was came from the two hundred fifty dollars buyout a few weeks ago, and it sold for nineteen ninety nine. Along with this was also in that two hundred fifty dollars cleanout. Uh, Indiana Jones, a complete DVD movie collection, sold for eighteen dollars. And shipping. it's unopened. And it's unopened. All right, we were just going to touch on a few of these comments. Um, here, you want to hold the camera there? All right, so there is this. We had a lot of comments. We had a lot of encouraging, uh, yes, please uh, do what we want you to do a live. We would attend. We had several of those. So Yay! we are going to do a live this weekend at the reseller event. I'm going to talk to several people that are going to be there that do lives all the time. So people I'm going to find out exactly. Know. Yeah, people, people smarter than we are, find out exactly what we should do or whatever to do that. But I'm thinking next week, well, I'm not going to say what Don't day for promise. sure, <laughs> but it will be sometime soon. I can tell you that much. Um, a few people, a couple people said that it's probably a scam. A couple people said that it's not a scam. Uh, it kind of went back and forth, but um, I do want to give a shout out to Fat Grandma Fines. Uh, she said that uh, I won't ship to a different address either. If they really want it, they'll reorder the correct shipping address, blah, blah, blah. I just wanted to give her a shout out because that is an awesome name, Fat Grandma Finds. I, I should that. use that one, but I don't <laughs> have any grandkids yet. We don't have grandkids. So. We have grandpuppies. Um, let's kitties. see. Somebody said, probably not a scam. It takes an arm and a leg to find where to change your address. Maybe show us how to do that. And I'll just tell you, mm. I, most everything I do on my phone and not on the computer 
on the phone it's super easy to find where to change your address um, all you have to do is go to on your eBay app you go to my eBay and then you go down to settings and it's the very first thing on there and it you can have several different addresses oh I'm in the spotlight you are you can have several different addresses like sometimes I'll buy something I'll ship it like to my mom's address so it's listed there so if I want to go and buy something I just se select that one and then you can leave it in there and then go back to your original one so it's it's actually really easy to do and really convenient which is kind of hard to believe sometimes for eBay a uh, quick Facebook update so far as of right now Donna is still not restricted anymore so we're moving forward with that and we're gonna hope for the best we're trying to think of different avenues and stuff but we'll see what happens in the future <laughs> look you guys we got buds coming on the trees see them oh uh, <gasps> look what i found shiny i have plants coming up oh my goodness i'm so excited <laughs> Sorry. No, you're... Squirrel. <laughs> Squirrel. <clears throat> Squirrel. All right. <laughs> All right. Um, somebody said, no, you don't have to set up local pickup and business policies on phone. Scroll to the bottom of shipping page, and there it is. Um, I can't. I tried to find that. Like, I, I went all over in here trying to find it, and I couldn't find it. So, I don't know. if Maybe we have different versions of app or something. I don't know for sure. But... There was one that talked about the Facebook thing and they talked about how they are in several groups where you have to tag people and there were a lot of bans going on. It's going on all across the country it's at a times. Bot. It's weird. I think it's a bot. But they did have somebody that... But I change uh, my mind every day. So. Yeah, we change our mind on what we think it is. Uh, but they did have somebody uh, completely banned and they can't get on Facebook anymore. So that is our biggest fear. Like if that happens, I felt a raindrop. Yeah, I or don't want Or a bird wanna... pooped on me, one or the oh, other. I felt a raindrop too. And then I also wanted to touch on one other thing. So I got a request to look into shipping on an item. This is something else, and I don't think I'm getting scammed, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Sold a pair of boots, sent them out. It shows they were delivered a week ago. The person messaged and said they never got them. So I'm like, well, it shows delivered. They talked to their post office, and they said that I sent them in a priority package with a... Uh, ground advantage shipping label and so they made it all the way there and instead of delivering the post office there told them they should have delivered it uh, with postage due but they instead shipped it all the way back here it's been a week I haven't seen that package yet I looked at the shipping label and it is a ground advantage and thinking back to when I was shipping this may have happened so they said they still want the boots so I'm actually hoping they show up but I mean if they file a did not deliver thing i mean i could just say oh well tracking says it was delivered because it does so anyway that's another situation like we deal with this kind of stuff from time to time and it's kind of a pain i am going to go out on a limb and say that they're not trying to scam me though because i've been proven wrong lately a lot <laughs> so anyway um we just have a few more things that we're shipping out we're going to show you let's go show let's because go do that. it's raining see the raindrops <laughs> Hey, how cool is it that it's raining and not snowing in the middle yes. of February? And we are in short Shout sleeves. Shout out to... Short sleeves. Yeah, we're out here in t-shirts. <gasps> that is... What? Keith and Bonnie's fault. <laughs> they put Keith. their snowblower in storage. Uh, yeah. Excuse me, Donna wants to put our snowblower in storage. We're gonna, too. Yeah, Keith and Bonnie stopped by yesterday and I said, well, if it snows, blame Donna because she wants to put her snowblower in storage and... And no. they laughed and they said, oh, we're doing that this afternoon, so. Because you can always go get it yes. if the forecast has snow, but it doesn't, it's raining. Yes. Oh my goodness. Look at that mess back there, you guys. Tana has a mess. The side looks nice and neat, though. What's next, see? I got a few little things and then one really, really cool sale that we thought was broken and it's not. Um, so first of all, we just have this Sony cassette tape. It's blank, uh, dynamic and brilliant response and that sold for $5 plus shipping. The guy wanted lots more of those. So if you guys have any of those, put them on. Yeah, he sent it off for five bucks. I'm like, whatever, plus shipping. Uh, and then he messaged, he's like, well, I would like five. I'm like, well, if I had five, I would gladly sell them to you, but I don't. Uh, yeah. This is a Monster High couch. And someone bought this in Mexico and they paid $10 plus shipping to get this Monster High couch. 
This is a replacement part for a Braun. Is that how you pronounce that? B-R-A-U-N. Food processor whisk piece. And that sold for $10 plus shipping. It's so little. And then there's only one more sale, but it's super cool. Look, look at that. Isn't that cool? This is a Yadro elephant. Pick him up and turn him so he can see. Yeah, he's beautiful. And he sold for $80.95. So shipping, I'm going to have to be really careful with the tusks and the, is that a horn? What do you call it? Trunk. It's not <laughs> Trunk. a horn, you ding dong. <laughs> okay, here's the horn. All right. No, and so this what is I do his is. Lip. No, I know. Tusks. Horn as in he makes a noise. Yeah. Oh. All right. So I'll put like crumpled paper, not real tight, but kind of in here. I'll, I'll do it all. Show us the bottom. I'll have packing peanuts. I'll have bubble wrap. I'll have paper. I'll have everything to make sure he gets there safely. Uh, there's the bottom. So when I got this out of the package, it was in paper. It was wrapped in paper. And I grabbed and I opened it and we had something kind of heavy had fallen and was leaning on it. And then I pulled it out and I heard that and I'm like, oh no, we broke the elephant. But... We opened it, it's not broken, and we remembered that when we got this and we listed it, it had this rattle. There's no chips, no nothing. We think they drilled this small hole in here, and I don't know why, I don't know what the reason is, but we think that when they drill the small hole, it just pushes in whatever piece was in there, maybe, mm -hmm. and so it rattles. But there's nothing broken, no chips or anything. So it's unique. $80.95. Where's and he going? He is going to... He's going to San Antonio, Texas. I've been to San Antonio once for a football no. game. Yeah. Anyway. Cool, cool. Wow. I don't know what kind Put of noise they make. Put him down. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> I'm the one that's got to ship him. What are you? Know, what are you careful. worried about? Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. That's it. That's it. Let's wrap this up. All right. All right. We got a lot of things going on because tomorrow morning we go to Omaha. No. We get to see our friends. Yeah, well, we think they're our friends. We haven't actually met anybody there. Well, Alicia, we did. But we haven't met anybody, so we're really looking forward to this. It's going to be super cool. Now I have anxiety. What if they don't like me? <laughs> if there's one thing I can tell you about us, it's that we don't really care. Since we started this YouTube channel, we just try to just be ourselves and not be like... That's why you don't yeah, see us go, Oh my gosh, look at this! Because we don't act like that. <laughs> so... I do sometimes. We should. Yeah, <laughs> she is amazed a lot. Um, yeah, we just. Anyway, I'm excited to we meet are what new we are. people. Yeah, we're excited to go. It's going to be a lot of fun. But we have a lot of things to do around here before we can go. Like cut your hair. She cut my hair. <laughs> do shipping. You know, go to the bank. Just do business stuff. We got to clean laundry. You know, all Laundry's kinds of things. Going. So last loads in. So lots to do. Not a lot of time to do it. Oh, we're going to go help Luke do baseboards <gasps> today. Yes. Oh my goodness, so, wait till you see the house, you guys. It's amazing. We will show you the house. We'll show you some before and afters later on when oh, Luke's done with amazing. it. So it's going to be cool. But anyway, thank you all for watching. Do you have anything else to Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Please do if you're watching this and you're not subscribed. And thank you. Thank you for all the comments. We love them. Yes, we do love the comments. It's awesome. Um, that's, I think, it. I'm hey, Steve. Steve. I'm Donna. <laughs> We're Happy Heart Treasures. And we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.